Listen, I appreciate the fact that the President came out today um, to express what um, we all believe, which is we didn't get everything we wanted, but we came up with a good compromise that's going to help the American people. This is about infrastructure. Every President over the past four or five Presidents has talked about doing a big infrastructure package. You may recall that President Trump proposed a $2 trillion infrastructure package. Today we are announcing the framework for an historic investment in infrastructure. This is roads and bridges, but also lots of other kinds of infrastructure, including broadband, including our water system and our rail system, all of which is good for the economy. This will lead to more efficiency in our economy, higher productivity, more economic growth. This is about the long term. And it's something that traditionally has been very bipartisan. And I'm pleased to see today that we're going to come together on a core infrastructure package. This is not non-infrastructure items. Without new taxes, and with the commitment from Republicans and Democrats alike, that we're going to get this across the finish line. So I appreciate my colleagues behind me. This is a team effort. Everybody was equally involved. Uh, Kirsten Cinnamon did a great job leading the effort, and I want to recognize Curtis if you would. Thank you, Rob.